guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. My name is Kent for those of you who are new here. So as you can see from the title of this video, I'm going to be doing what I eat in a day weekend edition. So today is Saturday. Um, I'm filming this just before dinner, hence why I look like this. I don't usually look like this in the morning, trust me. It's about five o'clock now. I'm gonna head out soon for dinner, um, but I have filmed clips throughout the day up until this point. Just starting the intro in here. So we're gonna start with breakfast and then get into the rest of it. I hope you guys enjoy. Please subscribe and like if you do, and let's get into it. faced pro post run red face what what <laughs> my brain is nowhere today i don't know what's wrong with me anyway this is the first time you guys are seeing me today so hello hi good morning you would have seen that i had a croissant with salmon and scrambled eggs this morning i had that in how bad a cute little restaurant called Deli delish because i was stayed there last night and i just went for a run on the seapoint promenade and you would have seen i got a smoothie this is just a strawberry whip. It's from New, which is like a little health restaurant. It's just got blend strawberries, banana, vanilla whey protein, and dates, I think. So that went down really well. And then I also got a salad because it's Saturday and I don't feel like cooking. So I'll show you what I have when I open this up. It is a chicken Caesar with like a cashew dressing. And then I'm going out for dinner tonight with a friend, which will be really fun. So I'll definitely film that as well. I look absolutely mad. So hopefully the next time you see me, I'll be looking a lot more put together. <laughs> but yeah, I will show you my lunch when I eat it in a little bit. So here she is. It's kale, uh, shaved parmesan, lettuce, chicken, crisp coconut pieces, tomato, and a creamy cashew dressing. It looks really good. I'm gonna tuck into it now. Can't believe how red I am. I'm. I mean, it was it was a it was a run and a half, but let's give this a go. Mmm, that dressing is super nice. My friend actually told me about this. I've never gotten it before. I used to really love their um, Alpha, I think it was. It had like goat's cheese and beetroot and walnuts and rocket. It was so delicious. Um, but I don't really like New's food so much. I like their breakfast and I love their smoothies. So I'm really happy I found a salad that I like from them. My obsession can continue. Mm. Hey guys, I just finished getting ready for dinner. I don't know how I feel about this. You can't really see in there. I don't really know how I feel about this top. Does anyone else think of the rock when they see a polar neck? You know, that one when he wore that like black polar neck with a chain around it. I don't know why whenever I wear something like this, I think of the rock. <laughs> so I need to get it out. It's really cold in Cape Town today. So I just want to be warm. I'm really excited. I'm not going to bring my camera because the bag I'm taking is too small and I don't want to lose it or have it stolen or whatever. So I'm going to leave it here, but I will film what I have on my phone and insert it. And I'll show you what I wear before I head out. I'll give you the full, the full show. I, I'm going a little bit extra tonight just because I haven't been out for a while and I just feel like it. So I'm wearing like colorful jackets. You'll see, I'll show you, but I'll check in with you guys when I am fully clothed. Okay, the jacket is on. Very extra, as I mentioned, but I'm feeling it. So let me show you the full outfit. So we've got on my trusty old boyfriend jeans with some boots, just black boots. Um, and then as you would have seen this, um, 
polar neck, which I think looks much better now that I've got the rest of the outfit on. I don't feel like I look so much like the rock anymore. <laughs> and then this big puffy jacket. And then simple makeup, just plain hoops. But yeah, I'm excited. Let's go to dinner. So I'm the worst. <laughs> Didn't film a single thing from that dinner. It just no, was not, yeah, brain was not in it. Did not even think about it, which shows I had a good time. So I'm really sorry about that. But I thought, since I was so terrible at filming what I ate for dinner that night, let's just carry this on into the next week. So it's now Tuesday. Didn't film yesterday because, well, I hadn't actually thought about doing this idea yet so it's Tuesday now but I thought let's do uh, what I eat in a few days because I am on my way to Red Sofa Cafe which is up the road from me and I'm going to go get some breakfast there and work there for the morning someone is just cleaning my flat now just let them in so gonna go get some breakfast there some coffee or something to drink um, and do work there for the morning and then pop to the shop get some stuff for lunch so I'm gonna show you guys a little mini grocery haul for the end of the week and then what I have for lunch and what I have for dinner and what I have for breakfast which will hopefully make up for my absolutely shocking lack of anything on Saturday so <laughs> here we go <laughs> As promised mini grocery haul for a kind of gonna be home this week cooking kind of not situation so two lemons because I've needed those for a while my trusty oat milk I got this for lunch it's just a bacon chicken and mayo wrap because I'm feeling lazy two things of oven roast vegetables uh, tzatziki punnet of raspberries green beans, these instant oats for my boyfriend and some special K for me. That's his milk. Uh, tuna, if you guys live in Fredahook, actually I don't know if I actually want to tell you the secret, but go to the spa because they have the most insane deals on fish. It's next level. Tuna, salmon, everything. Um, and then this Sun Life drink. I got my vaccine yesterday and I'm feeling a little bit under the weather, so not that that's going to help much, but you know. And some flowers for myself. I just think those are so beautiful because why not? So I'm going to put this all away and then I'm going to tuck into the wrap for lunch. Lunch is served and then I'm just having it with some chutney on the side. And I'm ready to tuck into this. A nap was had. Mm, I look insane. Oh my god. I just smashed my camera into the side of my thing. Don't know why I'm putting myself on the internet like this, but me alone. Choose time. I just had the best run. I'm so impressed with myself. I ran so far and so fast. And that does not happen very often. So I'm very, very pleased with my ability on that front. And I'm feeling so much better after that. I wasn't feeling amazing earlier. I'm not going to lie. I think um, I know the first day you get the vaccine, you 
feel like mild symptoms and I felt them very mildly but yeah I decided to just kind of push myself out of my funk and try sweat it out and I'm really glad I did because I feel so much better so West is coming for dinner tonight and we're gonna make some teriyaki pan fried tuna you guys obviously saw the one I bought earlier I'm gonna make that and what are we gonna have with that I think oven roasted veggies with green beans and tzatziki I think that'll be super nice um, but yeah, I will show you guys when I'm busy making that. I'm sorry, but how do people do these? Like, I don't know. I used to wear them all the time, but I swear my hair was thinner. Um, and now, like, I just don't know. It doesn't go around my hair. Like, they don't close properly. So, I mean, I'm, are they too small for my hair? Like, I could do this vibe, which I know a lot of people do, and then it works. But then I feel like I look like a pineapple. I don't know. If you guys have these claw clips and you know how to make and you know how to make them look nice in your hair, um, please give me some advice in the comments down below because I'm not doing so well with them. <laughs> and I much prefer them to scrunchies because I just feel like my hair maintains its like smoothness, I guess. Whereas scrunchies they're kind of Pull your hair up a bit but anyway i'm rambling and this is not about food anymore so forgive me um <laughs> i will check in with you guys when dinner is ready okay we've got the veggies out i just popped them on the baking tray with olive oil and um, some fresh rosemary and garlic salt um, and yeah i'm gonna cook those up and then we'll pan fry the tuna and I'll add the green beans to this closer to when they're done because green beans obviously cook very quickly. So, yum! Okay guys, that is it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. I'm so sorry that it was a little bit chaotic and all over the place, um, but I hope it was still entertaining at least. And yeah, please like if you enjoyed, please comment if you want to, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!